In movies, we are shown that whenever a person gets hit by a bullet, so he dies immediately. But in reality it is not like that at all. Whenever a person gets shot in the heart, it takes 3 to 8 minutes for death, and due to more pressure in the left side of the heart as compared to the right side, more blood flow after being shot, and death happens immediately. But if a victim is shot in the head with 90% accuracy, so after being shot, the victim will immediately become unconscious, and he will die immediately without suffering too much. Actually bullet is not called a bullet, rather it is known as cartridge, and only the front part of the cartridge is called as bullet, which is made of lead. Lead is a slow poison, that's why the possibility of death increases after getting shot. The back part of the cartridge is called the case, in which the explosive matter, gunpowder, is filled, and this gunpowder gives energy to the bullet during firing, that leads to the bullet enters the victim's body and cause death. The biggest reason for death by bullet is, Shock. The high energy impact produced by the bullet also crushes bones. As a stone thrown into water creates waves in it. In the same way, when a bullet enters your body at a speed of 1,500 miles per hour, so it generates a kind of shock wave, because of which victim feel an intense jerk inside the body. The shock wave causes wear and tear apart the organs, and cause heavy damage in system. It has been seen in many cases that, bone fracture occurs due to bullet injury, while the bullet gets stuck in the between the muscles and does not even touch the bone. This is the best example to understand shock wave. When a bullet hits the chest, then the person dies due to tension pneumothorax, because there are no muscles in the lungs, and when a bullet is fired, a negative pressure is created in it, due to which the lungs are compressed inside the pleural cavity, and the process of breathing ceases. In a 2007 Iraq shootout between a US Navy SEAL and terrorists, a soldier named Mike Day was hit by 27 bullets and a grenade. Despite being hit by so many bullets, he survived to tell his incredible story. The possibility of survival of any victim depends on the part of the body that is damaged by the bullet during firing. Gunshot wounds cause severe bleeding, fractures, nerve and soft tissue damage. And if the victim does not get timely treatment, then he dies within a few minutes. The victims who get shot in the front part of the head, they have a higher survival rate as compared to being shot from the left or right side. This is because a bullet that hits the front of the head damages only one of the two hemispheres of the brain, while a bullet fired from the left or right side usually damages both the hemispheres.